This is an image of the total lunar eclipse from March 2025, and this is an illusion that shows the size of the Earth's shadow. Looking at a time lapse of the eclipse, you can see the Earth's shadow moving across the moon. At any point during the time lapse, the shadow forms an arc. Completing the arc gives you an estimate of the full size of the Earth's umbra, or darkest part of the shadow. If I align several images from the time lapse together, you get an illusion of the shadow. Your brain connects the arcs together. Also, during a lunar eclipse, stars don't get washed away due to the moon's brightness. If we slow down the time lapse, you can see that the stars are moving faster than the moon in the night sky. Of course, the Earth is rotating, which makes both the moon and stars seem like they're moving in the sky, but the moon's distance and motion to the Earth relative to the stars makes it seem like the moon is moving a bit slower than the stars. And about twice a year, the Earth and moon line up just right for a lunar eclipse. Although, not all lunar eclipses are total eclipses. 